Hi everyone, it's Adelami here from Kairos Designers. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to achieve this drag in and drag out prototype sets in Figma. You know, it's something that looks really, really simple and believe me, it is. So we are going to be looking at that in this video. Stick with me till the end as this is something that you can apply to other use cases. Without further ado, let's get started. So you're welcome to this YouTube channel if this is your first time. If this isn't, you're welcome back. As I said in the intro, this video is going to teach you quickly how to achieve the notification dragging and drag out prototype setting in Figma. Here at the Kairos Designers, we are focused on helping designers level up their skills even as we continue on our own journey. Um, let's get right to it. As you can see, I've removed the prototype setting. So if you drag or drag, no matter what, nothing is going to happen. So we have our home screen and we have our notification bar. So all we are going to need to do to achieve that animation setting is to first make sure that this your status bar here is independent of the home screen itself. When I say the home screen itself, the full screen. So you can see that if you click on it, it is separate from the full screen so you can independently edit it and for this also okay for your home indicator just make sure that you can edit it separately so it's like in a different frame on its own while even being a part of the notification bar screen itself so just straight to the prototype setting so now you see your interaction details coming up here. I'm going to drag it to the middle a bit to just allow you to see it more. Now, instead of on tap, on tap, just make sure to change it to on drag. Now, once you've changed it to on drag, you know that what we want to achieve is to when we drag this down, so it is coming in this direction. So if, as you can see here, you have the left direction, right direction, down and up. But in this case, we want to drag down. You can even see it here. You can see the setting here. So it's like going up. But once you bring it this way, so it's like coming down. So one is like dragging down. So let's check here to see if it has been achieved. All right, now navigate to notification bar. Move in, move in. So that's going to be move in. So it comes in. So let's check here. And that's that's it for the dragging. So now if you see to drag out, we are trying to drag out, but nothing is happening yet. Now, to achieve the drag out part, you just have to select this on drag, navigate to the back to the home screen. Now, let me show you something quickly. You see, we still retain the setting for the home screen to notification bar animation. So once we do this or once you try to drag it doesn't work but once you try to drag this you see at the bottom here something is trying to show at the top so you have to make sure that you are precise with these details so now the way we want it is because we are dragging it this in this direction you are dragging it in this direction so you select this way but it is to be moved out so it moves out not moves in so uh once you do that you can see so we'll go again put this this way you know, drag it so you can see it's something that is very very easy to achieve now if we had put in move in from here let's say when we drag this in and we'll try to drag this you can see it's coming from the bottom which is not how it is so it is meant to be move out so i'll put this detail again for you to see so I'll just wait two seconds or you can just pause at this point to replicate it and for the home screen part you can just pause again to replicate it check through and make sure that yours is also correlating with what i have done here so that's it for this video let's go through the animation again just smooth and easy to achieve so if you learned something or if you think this is something that you would like to see more of in future, if you aren't subscribed yet, make sure to do that now. 
And if you think this is something that someone around you has been asking, that new designer has been asking on how to achieve, make sure to just share this video with them. You can also comment on animations or other things that you're finding hard in your learning journey with Figma that you would like us to just help you with. So we might make specific videos depending on need. So that's what we do here at the Carol's Designers. Thank you so much for watching this video and we'll see you on the next one. Bye for now.